All right, hello everyone. Here we are. I'm back setting up for hole number seven of the pro guide. And this is going to be the revision where I go out towards the right, lay up, and we'll just try to focus on making the pitch. Should be very straightforward. Um, I do highly recommend going this way because of how simple it's going to be. It's going to be a very straight angled wind and we're going to give ourselves a really good chance to make this one. What I'm going to use for the approach is going to be a plus zero and power one ball and thorn. So I'm just going to go ahead and set that up pre and then we're just going to get it up to that spot and try to focus on you know, it shouldn't be too much distance. It should only be about maybe two rings or so, two to three rings here. It's a little bit of power. Um, it shouldn't be very hard to get out here. Uh, can say, ooh, that was a lot closer than I wanted it to be. But here you can see that we can just, you know, basically hit it out here towards the middle. Make sure that it's past the trees, very little power. And plenty enough to give us a very good, reasonable angle um, the only thing you know we, we probably end up a little bit more towards mid club with the way that you know I'm playing kind of away from the rough there so I you know like I mentioned I do really recommend that you guys go over this way um, do be a little careful of that extra mile you could see that I almost did hit that rough patch it was within a yard or two but it was very very tight to the rough and you have to, you know, play some wind. I was playing about two rings. It seemed to have, um, you know, after I played about two rings and then great balled it, that was about a three ring, which was very, very tight to be in too close to that edge. But here you can see we're both out here perfectly in the fairway. Um, one of the reasons, you know, you don't need tighten, so it's kind of a wasted ball. You can see that I've drove it to where my opponent does. And not only that, you know, we, we're kind of, um, I'm not going to need side spin either. So here's min club. I'm going to probably be about here, 2.1 rings or so. And I'm going to just play, you know, no elevation here. And just put the ball guide right in front of the cup like this. 2.1 rings. Should give myself a very good, reasonable chance for holdout here, as I was mentioning. Perfect ball. <clears throat> Straight into the pin. So you'll see that, uh, you know, more times than not, just laying up and going that way, you're going to give yourself a very good precision type shot that uh, you know hopefully you guys can start honing in and get those short irons down just take some practice but once you get it um, you know you're all over those things it either goes in or it's right on the edge um, but hopefully you know with with a little bit of practice on this hole once you start to see it you know this is kind of the third time that I've kind of seen this one from this angle so it really helps me to um, you know really know in terms of adjustment how much this one looks a little bit light. So my opponent only went about a ring and a half. So they're going to more than likely um, miss on the right edge here. <clears throat> also, just a tad bit short as well. But you can see that it would have just missed on the right. So good luck with that seventh hole, guys. Hopefully, you know, one of those methods works for you and you're able to get that one. It's going to be a very important hole to be getting for this tournament. So, um, you know, good luck, like I mentioned, and catch you guys on the next one.